For dinner tonight I made something simple. Macaroni and cheese with hamburger mixed in it. It's really good stuff. And Don just got home. Yep, just got home. Welcome home. Yeah. How was your day? Alright. It was fairly busy. Did you get all the hours you wanted to today? Well, I got seven. Okay. So, yeah. I got seven hours today. Well, that's good. Yeah. It's kind of hot today now. Yeah. It was 79 last time I checked. Yeah, it wasn't too bad all the way up until I uh, went to leave work and shut everything down, and then it was like, oh shit, just got punched in the face with heat. Yeah, I have all the windows open, all the ceiling fans on. Yeah. I Not work. complaining, it's just this is the first actual kind of hot day of 2021. Yeah, at work we had uh, all the shop exhaust, we had all the exhaust fans going, fans going, and Wait didn't until feel bad in there until I walked outside. Wait until July when it's 9,500 degrees. Yeah. <laughs> mm, I'm standing back way welding. My arm's tucked out. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Stay away from the heat of the bleed. Jeez. That's how I welded all day. My arm feels, my right arm feels kind of heavy from holding it out like this all day. Yeah. Welding. Huh. I bet you'll wake up with a sore arm. Probably.
So now it's the next day, and I just got done editing everything that you got, you guys saw, and when I was doing that, I realized I was stupid yesterday, and I did not film a hello clip. I thought I did. Maybe it wasn't recording. Maybe I dreamed I did it. I don't know, but whatever. And it's 81 degrees today, which is getting pretty hot, but it's pretty nice. And Don just got home from work. He's very dirty from all the welding and grinding and whatever you do there. I didn't there. get to do much welding today. I spent more time cutting up steel pipe than anything today. Yeah, well, it's a dirty job. Yep. It's a dirty job, but somebody's got to do it. Yeah. If anybody remembers that show. I used yep, to watch it all the jobs. time. Yeah, I used to watch that all the time. Yeah, you'd think living around here there's a lot more welders than what there are, but there ain't many welders around this area. Yeah, and all the welders there are go work at Moran Ironworks. Yeah. But I'm just surprised, you know, that there ain't many welders around here just because of Moran Ironworks. Yeah. You know, and then the college also for it. Yeah. So he brought this home. He says it's a throwing knife and it is not finished. So a work in progress. These are the kinds of things they do when they aren't making the trenching spades. So, not sharp yet, but it will be. Is it's it? It's already been stuck in the wall a few times already. Is it going to have a wooden handle? Huh. No, no wooden handle, not like that. Just knock the rough edges off it, sharpen up, sharpen up the edge, give it a better point. And that's that. Yeah. So the wall is officially done. He doesn't have to dry wall mud anymore or sand anymore or any of that. But now we have to clean it all up because there's white dust everywhere. Not just in here, but in the whole house. I didn't know it would be such a big ridiculous mess. Like that over there. It looks like it snowed in here. Looks like it snowed. Yeah. But we're in the home stretch now. It's almost done. Now, there really wasn't that much sanding to really be done, it, but when you sand it, just fucking goes everywhere. But that's the perk of dry sanding. Yeah, I know. But when you wet sand, you don't, it don't do that when you wet sand. Yeah. But I don't... I'm White storm! Far, but I'm definitely far from being an expert on doing dry walls. Well, so. I think he did a good job. So does White Storm. He wants to come and be affectionate to say thank you. Oh, yeah? Yeah. So Don's finally getting started on painting. So this nasty looking wall is going to look a whole lot better real soon. <laughs> Just a little tiny bit. He does have a roller. Of course I won't film the whole thing of him doing the wall because that'll bore you guys. But he's definitely getting started. So there's the first coat. Don says it needs more. It looks streaky like that because it's still wet. Of course it has to dry first. But already it looks a whole lot better than it did. And the white van and the white trim are going to look really good on there. Along with the Dorian Gray paint. Dinner tonight is barbecued chicken and little mini tater tots. And this is what I used. Rufus Teague made some sauce. Spoken Chipotle. And we have four other flavors of this. No, they're not all sugar-free. I found them at Meyer, and they're really, really good. This is the second flavor we've tried. I know this one is a little spicy. Well, it's definitely getting late. 8.35. We're eating late, and Don is still working on the wall. But we're going to go ahead and say good, good night, and we hope you enjoyed the video, and that you like, subscribe, comment, share, and you're having a good night. Say good night. Say good morning. And we'll see you next time.